So we just got a ferry off the island, got a tuk-tuk to come find our bus, and the bus station was shut. So we're traveling with a, a company called OLP. Terrible reviews on Google. Uh, it's classed as a hotel bus, but it doesn't look great. So we've got a double beds to share. It's built for short people, as they all are. But we are, we've got about an 11 and a half hour journey to see Henry. Here's to me. So we're just on our sleeper bus. Look. Hang on, that's what we got. We're not, we're not just uh, That's me sharing a single for a laugh. This is a double. <laughs> but it's only 12 hours. <laughs> Six o'clock in the morning. We have made it to see him reap. So we made it to the hostel. The chilled backpackers hostel. Of course we are here at Four past six before my night bus. And we don't check in until someone leaves, which probably won't be about until 10 11. So. <laughs> DM Reap. We made it. Bus was surprisingly okay, just very, very warm. There was aircon, but it actually only heated. Uh, called the front of the bus and we were at the back above the engine and it didn't do much but quite a good night's sleep considering everything it was very narrow actually like we couldn't both lay down flat because our shoulders were too wide it wasn't a double it was a large sleep. 175 each so 350 for these banging looking tacos Got pork and beef. No way. How did you do that? It's 5am. We're just heading to a temple to go watch the sunrise. Looking very fashionable. This was a Hindu temple, and now it's been a Buddhist temple, and now it's no temple. So we have stopped, had some breakfast, because it's only 8.28pm, AM, AM, and we have come to well, arguably one of the more famous temples here. Famous because of... Famous because of big boobs, Lara Croft. And maybe Indiana Jones. Potentially Indiana Jones, yeah. A what? A popo. So, what we're going to find out more of. Rats. So, a popo is where they raise the rats, train them to find disused landmines. Because after all the problems in the 70s, due to the Khmer Rouge, 
has uh, shed a load of landmines to the belt, still causing problems for the locals. And then sit down, face in this direction. Okay, and then we come in with the sign and the rope, set us the boundary, and then later on we have the rats to come in to pinpoint where they are. So it's a teamwork here, the dogs they come in first, and then the rats to find the exact location of this evil stuff. Now we attach uh, all the way into the metal wire Okay, so inside the plot here, we have two metal containers, but the one right there, nothing inside, it's empty. Just no more metal to Valerie. Yes, Valerie just checking on it. But this kind of no smell to TNT. But it looks familiar to the one with TNT. But that doesn't pull her so she's just moving it along. But also, you see she starts crushing there. She's raising up her nose to smell more clearly inside her brain. She's marking the position where the smell is coming from. And then when she is gone, she will scratch on top of it. That is the signal from her, so our handler, keeping close eye at her. Okay, so we communicate it back to her, telling her that Valerie is having food for here. <laughs> yes, she got banana. Well done, girl. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> but not too much, too high in calories. Okay, Jenny, girl. <gasps> <laughs> it's my favorite one. Good <laughs> job. Oh, <laughs> you got any banana? Uh. <laughs> So we've just come to this temple up this hill. This one's best known for sunset. So we've come for sunset. We've managed to skip the rain by getting a coffee. So the ground is now very moist. And we're in flip flops. And we're in flip flops and sandals. My garden in sandals. Um, but there's a lot of cloud in the sky. So we'll see if we can see it. One thing to note, if you buy a ticket for $37, to go to all the temples. If you go after 5 p.m., you can get in in the evening <clears throat> the day before. However, if you do that, you have to buy the ticket from the ticket office. Not online, like we did. If you do that, the writing of the dates is black, and that means you're not allowed in until the exact date. If the writing is red, you can go in the night before. After five. After five. So you can see two sunsets essentially. <coughs> little handy tip for you because we did it, so you don't have to. <laughs> Two minutes to the top to watch the beautiful sunset. Unfortunately, it's cloudy. It's cloudy, cloudy. Still quite beautiful though. So we're just driving through the night market. Yes, driving through the night market. And is pretty buy some small. Trousers, buy some t-shirts. <laughs> buy something. Just looking. Now we don't actually know where we're going. We saw some pretty lights down here, so we're going to give that a go.